It's uh, Patricia Perez, uh, P-A-T-R-I-C-I-A, uh, last name Perez, P-E-R-E-Z. And are you the mother of Joe Perez Jr.? Yes. Is that your only son? No, I have um, two older sons as well. Now I'm going to ask that this witness be handed an item. Ms. Perez, do you recognize the item that's just been handed to you? Yeah. And can you describe that photograph? This is taken at a, his uh, second cousin's birth. It was a picture that was taken. He, uh, I used to call him Kim K. He used to love to take photographs. He was a selfie king. <laughs> and is that a photograph of your son, Joe Perez Jr.? Yes, it is. And Your Honor, at this time, I would ask permission to publish that photograph and also ask that it be introduced as the next numbered exhibit, which I believe is number nine. Ms. Perez, what is your son's birthday? September 22nd, 1997. And in April of 2018, how old was your son? He was 20 years old. And how long had he been living in Nashville? Um, exactly four months. Um, his brother had came up here to open up a business. Um, his brother's business expanded. Um, he wanted family. So we were all going to make the move to Nashville together. Um, but he asked Joey um, to come down first because the business was getting bigger. So Joey decided to go ahead and, and come with his brother at, the, at that time. So I drove him down here to Nashville on uh, December 22nd of uh, 2017. And did your son, did he have a car that he drove when he lived in Nashville? Yeah, he had a uh, 2007 Honda uh, Civic. Um, like I said, I drove him down here just to make sure that he got, got here safe. Um, that was one of the things that we agreed on, and I flew home. And, uh, yeah. And after April 22nd of 2018, did you see his car again? Yeah, on, uh, on the day that the incident, my mother called me to inform me that uh, Joey hadn't made it home. And she had witnessed something on the TV and um, she was worried and she wanted me to call Joey because Joey always answered me. I called, he didn't answer, I didn't get anything, and then um, I asked my mo mother to wake up my son and tell my son to go to his cousin's house, but I ended up pinging Joey's phone, and it pinged at the Waffle House. That's where we, I sent his brother to, and his brother found out. Next, I flew out. Next day, Ms. Perez, I don't mean to interrupt you, but I need to ask you specifically about the car. Okay. So when, when you saw the car again, was there anything wrong with it? Yes. It um, the flashers were on, and when I went with the key to go and drive the car, we were going to drive the car back to my son's house. He had a flat. So he had a flat tire on it. He had a flat tire on the front driver's side. Okay. Thank you, Ms. Perez. I don't have any other questions. No questions, 
Pleasure. Blanche Anderson.